what is up you guys welcome back to another vlog this is gonna be a short vlog but I'm gonna uh, be doing some cutting on this cow tray or whatever you guys want to call it so once you remove this you pretty much have access to everything on your engine bay but on these sections right here is where the DME box is and it gets covered and it's been raining and water does go over the DME box sometimes I mean it's hard to get to but water will go in there so what I'm gonna do is since I'm not using this piece because I have cow filters I am gonna be cutting down here pretty much where the the brace is same thing over here and then cutting straight down here because I at least want the DME cover to be boxed out that way when it's raining the water doesn't go in because that's going to be covering it so that's what we're going to be doing we're going to cut this up first and then I'll go show you guys on the car how it looks So I pretty much drew my outline of where I'm going to be cutting. This is just like an estimate. I used a grinder. Just be careful because this, this thing does melt so don't touch it. So now what I'm going to do is I will be cutting up to here and then just straight down. And then once we reach here I'm going to cut straight down. Same thing here straight down right here on the edge of this. And we're gonna cut this so yeah let's start doing that and then see how it goes stripping we want it pretty much gonna cut it at the edge right here So now we're gonna cut straight down on the edges that I showed you guys. So start cutting that apart.
There you go. So there's that piece. I am going to use the weather stripping to put it on the edges. Because I know the M3 ones are practically like this and it looks clean. But I'm not trying to buy one. So I just went this route and just decided to cut it up. So we're going to start kind of filing those edges. I got a little Dremel. So I'm going to go around the little edges and then start putting that uh, weather stripping on that I have right here. Cut it to size and then we're going to go test fit it on the car. guys so i took the weather stripping off of that piece pretty much garbage now and we're gonna cut i already smoothened this out all around so now we're just gonna cut the size to that and that slap the weather stripping on and then go test fit it on the car and see how it looks all right guys so pretty much use the blade cut the weather stripping to the length and also right there Everything is good. Now we just gotta go test fit it on the car. I am gonna clean this up though before I go put it in the car. So I'll show you guys once it's on the car. All right guys, so what I was trying to tell you guys, here's the engine bay. So pretty much that piece covers this entire thing and all of this. So now with that piece cut, it should sit along the trim right there and right there i'm gonna remove these plastic pieces and then just tuck the wire somewhere in there just so it's not like that but when it's raining or you get water you're washing your car water does fall in here because this is where the dme is and it's right under this plastic cover so to prevent that that's why i got that so i cut it because right here is where that's gonna sit and it has a cover and it has this piece right here and that's where pretty much the water will flow through not allowing it to go straight down in here because if that gets messed up that's a very expensive fix and i'm not trying to deal with that so let me start putting this on and then i'll show you guys how it looks all right guys so that's pretty much how it sits the bar on this is a bit bent it should have been more up here but it is what it is but other than that that looks good and now all we have to do is put the cover on top of here and now when it rains or whatever the water will just go straight here and down into the it'll go straight down into this and i don't have to worry about water getting into the dme but yeah it looks good so now we just got to put these covers back on this this slides in here. Look at that. That looks so clean. Now we just need this one. So let me put this on and then I'll show you guys. And just like that guys, there it is. Both sides covered. It's clean. I'm gonna tuck all these wires away. Probably later, not right now. It's about to start raining. So, yeah. That looks way better. And now I feel more safe. That water is not going to get into my DME. But, yeah, that's pretty much going to be it for today's video, guys. I just wanted to show you guys what I did to cover this up. Since I didn't want to buy the M3 one, I just cut up that, that piece and used reused the weather stripping that came with it and it came out good but other than that guys that's gonna be it hope it helped you guys and i'll catch you guys on the next video